Welcome to the Crossfield Elementary Library. Today we'll be going over the shelving organization here at Crossfield. There are six major sections in our library. Biographies, nonfiction, easy books, everybody, and fiction. Each section has its own shelving scheme. Biographies all have a call number that begin with 92. They are then shelved alphabetically by the subject's last name. There is a special collective biography section after the letter Z. These are books with call numbers 920 to 928. These collective biographies should not be shelved in the general nonfiction. Regular nonfiction is shelved in numeric order, starting with 0, 0,100 all the way to 999. If two books have the same number, then they will be shelved alphabetically within that number. The easy section is directed more towards my emerging readers like kindergarten and first grade. The easy nonfiction section is shelved just like regular nonfiction in numerical order. The biggest difference is that all easy nonfiction have a bright yellow sticker on them. This is a visual reminder that they have their own section. The easy biographies are shelved at the end of the easy nonfiction section. There are also state books on top of the easy nonfiction section. Please shelve them here by state. Do not shelve them in the general nonfiction. The other side of the easy section is easy fiction. These are early beginning to read books. They all have a blue dot sticker on their spines. When shelving these books, check for series first. Anything that is a part of a series will go into a blue bin. These are my most frequently check out books, so having the bins makes it easier for students to get what they want quickly. All other books are not a part of a series, get shelved alphabetically. The everybody books are picture books for readers from 2 to 102. They get shelved across two sets of bookcases in ABC order by author's last name. At the end of the everybody section, following the Z's, are my holiday picture books. These books are sorted in ABC order within the calendar year. So they begin in February with Groundhog's Day all the way until Kwanzaa on December 26th. All holiday books are labeled with their own holiday stickers. Please do not shelve holiday books with the regular everybody books. There are also three unique everybody locations within the story steps. The first is a dollhouse bookcase. In this dollhouse, books with classic characters are shelved. D.W., Arthur, Berenstein Bears, Curious George, and Clifford. These are all tagged with character stickers to make shelving easier. Since each character is shelved with its like books, there's no order to their shelving. Go ahead and just throw them on the shelf. The other two unique Everybody books are found in the green and pink bins on the story steps. The green bin is full of Lego books. These all have the same sticker and can just be put right in the bin. The pink bin is for princess books and they also have the same spine sticker and can just be put right in the bin. The fiction section is the one with the greatest amount of subsections. At the beginning, you'll find the magazines. Each magazine has its own bin except for the Lego magazine. Just put return magazines into bins and the Lego one on the ledge. My fiction novels are genrefied into 13 major sections. Animals, adventure, scary, sports, mystery, fantasy, science fiction, historical fiction, humor, graphic novels, story collections, and quick reads. Within the fiction on the big bookcases, each genre is sorted by color labels. No need to memorize every color. Just shelf ABC order within the different colors. Graphic novels are all tagged with a red graphic novel sticker and sorted in ABC order, even if it has a nonfiction call number on it. 
The story collection can be found at the bottom of the graphic novel section. They all have an SC call number and are sorted in ABC order. Books on CDs follow my realistic fiction section and again are sorted in ABC order. The quick reads are first chapter books that all have neon pink spine labels. Just like the blue dot books, major series are placed in baskets. The others are shelved in ABC order on the shelves. The last two shelving locations are behind the circulation desk. I have very popular playways that only my sixth graders can check out. These are MP4 players with fully loaded books. They all get shelved on the small bench by the library cards. Since they're in and out so quickly, there's no order, just throw them right on that little bench. Finally, there are the Battle of the Books books. These are all tagged with two stickers, one that says Bob and one that tells the grade level. Fourth gets shelved together and like titles go together. And fifth and sixth grade follow the same organization. All the fifth together with the like titles together, and in sixth, all the sixth go together with the like titles together. All books that are ready for shelving can be found on the three carts behind the circulation desk. All books are organized into their area on the carts before shelving. Feel free to shelve in a way that makes you comfortable whether that be alphabetizing the shelf before you go or doing it as you go. You may take the cart out onto the floor or only take a few at a time. It's up to whatever makes you feel comfortable. Thank you for helping keep our library going.